When it comes to uninterruptible power supplies, not all are created equal. Let's take a look at one of the primary differentiators in the GE offering eBoost technology. Hello, I'm Mark Townsend, GE's three-phase UPS systems engineer. Today we are going to demonstrate GE's eBoost technology. Here we have a system of two GE 500 kVA machines with the system loaded at 50%. For this demonstration, we are measuring efficiency using a Yokogawa 1600 power meter using high accuracy CTs. You can see with the system running at partial load online and double conversion that the efficiency is approximately 92% with the batteries in the circuit. I am now going to place the GE UPS system into high efficiency eBoost operation. So what just happened? Well, all the non-essential components within the UPS have turned off. The non-essential fans, the input filter, and the inverter. If you look at the front display, the inverter drive signals are ready to turn the inverter on within two milliseconds, should the system call for it. And also, if you look at the efficiency screen, the efficiency has jumped all the way up to 98%, which means a 6% gain in efficiency from double conversion. Many people think that running in high efficiency mode or eBoost means the UPS is in static bypass. That could not be further from the truth. When a UPS is running in eBoost mode, the inverters are ready to come on in two milliseconds or less, and all utility transients are prevented from reaching the load. Additionally, when running in eBoost, there's an LC filter providing passive filtration at all times. So as you can see, eBoost and static bypass mode are completely different. What I'm going to do now is simulate a utility failure by opening the main breaker to the entire UPS system and then quickly reclose it. You will see both modules instantaneously transfer to inverter. Then once eBoost realizes that the utility is turned, both modules will simultaneously transfer back to eBoost mode. What you just saw was the system utility fail. Both UPS modules went into backup battery mode with inverters coming on simultaneously. Then when the utility returned, both rectifiers came back on. Additionally, both UPSs transferred to eBoost mode immediately. You can see here looking at the waveform that there is very little deviation in the output system voltage. Thank you for watching our GE demonstration. eBoost, also known as multi-mode, is just one of the many GE UPS innovations that help our customers run an efficient and reliable operation.